Hi there, this is Craig Beck, the Stop Drinking Expert. Welcome into today's video blog. Uh, now, usually with my video blogs, I do try and keep it lighthearted because I don't think anybody needs to be told about the dangers of alcohol. It's like smokers know that smoking is bad for them, drinkers know that alcohol is bad for them. It's, it will come as no surprise to you if I give you the stats on that. But I do get specific questions asked quite regularly, so I thought I'd address one of them today. And that's from, uh, from women who've just become pregnant and they're drinking. And this is the first time perhaps they've ever considered stopping drinking. They want to stop for their child and they always thought they could do it like that and then suddenly they have to do it and they realize that they're addicted and it seems to be a lot harder than, than they thought it would be. And the question I get asked about is what is fetal alcohol syndrome? Uh, so we're just going to address that briefly today just so you understand what it is and it'll give you a bit more weight to your argument as to why you're going to stop drinking. Um, not just for your pregnancy but hopefully permanently. You see, the problem we've got is, as adults, uh, what we don't appreciate is just how much work our liver is doing on our behalf to clean this poison out of our system when we drink. It's very efficient and it will take a lot of abuse until it can't do any more than it gives in. But in the unborn child, the liver isn't developed properly. It's, it's not a properly functioning liver. And unfortunately, alcohol crosses the placenta, so it goes straight into your baby. And your baby has no way to filter the poison like we do. And unfortunately, this has a more dramatic effect on the baby's brain at a very important time in its development. During those first three months, your unborn baby is developing its facial features. And so fetal alcohol syndrome is a very visible, very traumatic result of drinking during pregnancy. And some of the symptoms of this are truly horrific. Very small heads. Um, you can find that the, the eyes are disproportionately small in the child. Lots of other facial defects. There's problems between the upper lip and the, the nose in this sort of area here. Uh, I mean, really, the sort of things that you really wouldn't wish on your worst enemy, never mind your unborn child. So fetal alcohol syndrome is a very, very serious complication of ingesting poison. And that's exactly what alcohol is. It's just that the whole world has been brainwashed into believing that alcohol has some benefits. Now, I'm not going to go on too much about this because if I talk too much about all the horrible things that happen when you drink, you get stressed. And when drinkers get stressed, what do they do? They drink because they believe that it helps with stress. As members of my online Stop Drinking Club know, that's not true. That's nonsense. Alcohol does not help with stress. And when you get inside the members area, I will explain why. But uh, hopefully that gives you a little bit of insight on what alcohol fetal syndrome is. Uh, sorry, fetal alcohol syndrome, wrong way around, FAS it's called. Um, it's a horrific thing. If you are, have just become pregnant and you need some help to stop drinking, please get in touch with me uh, and I'll point you in the right direction. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Craig Beck from StopDrinkingExpert.com.